Question 22. This pie chart shows the ingredients to make a food mixture for wild birds. So on the pie chart, we've got millet, suet, dried breadcrumbs and sunflower seeds. And we're asked to estimate the percentage of the mixture that is suet. So we're looking at the section here, this section, suet. And what we're going to do is to estimate the percentage, we're going to think about percentages on a pie chart. So the whole thing, the whole pie chart, that's going to be 100%. So if I split the pie chart in half here, then I've got my 50%, that's half the pie chart. But we're nowhere near that, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to split it again, I'm going to split it into quarters. So each of these quarters is 25% of the pie chart. And I can look at my section that's suet, and I can see that it isn't quite a quarter, it's a bit less than that. So I'm going to estimate it at about 20%. I could also have done that by looking at the size of the section and seeing that it's about a fifth, which is also 20%. Okay, moving on to the next section. It says Nina uses 100 grams of millet in the mixture. Estimate how many grams of sunflower seeds she should use. So this section here, millet, this section represents 100 grams. So if I look at the size of this section here, I'm going to use that to estimate the size of this section here, sunflower seeds. So I know that millet is 100 grams, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to do it by eye. I'm just going to look and see, well, how many times does that sort of size fit into my sunflower seeds? So I'm going to see 100 grams, 100 grams, 100 grams, 100 grams. And I can see that it's slightly more than that. And when the examiner's marking this question, they're going to be looking for an answer between, one, uh, between 300 and 400, because that's how many times it would fit in, between three and four times. So it's slightly more than three times. I'm going to estimate it as about 320 grams, because it's more than 300.